Hell yeah, I do. Don't make me chase you, pig boy.
Oh. How do you do it? I thought you were shot. I got better. The bitch is bit. Oh, you're gonna shoot me again? That worked so well for you last time. <laughs> yeah. Hey. You know, I might not have enough silver to kill you, but I could sure make you suffer. Travis, Silver, get on up here, boy. Oh, shit. What's your position? Where are you? Hey! Everybody fucking stop right now! Shoot her. Take her face off. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother, too. Yo, come on, man. This is you... my knife. No, please. Please. Nobody takes my knife. You stabbed me. You're leaking red like a juice box. No. Oh, please, you, you can... You can help me. No, man, you're bleeding out. The only thing I can do is put you out of your misery. Humane like. Uh, uh, uh. Oh! Laura! 
Oh no, you've been bit! Pick on someone your own size. Travis! <sighs> <sighs> Oh, easy. Easy. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? I'm so sorry. Huh. That bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how are you? I mean, I didn't want to say it, but... You shouldn't have come with me. You think? Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan. If you let me bite you... What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected. Which means... Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah. Yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life, and mine, and Max's and your friend's too. Let you bite me, and live to kill Chris Hackett, or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call, for now. So we doing this or no? Do it. and tender for you. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. Bobby? Fuck. We gotta go. What? We uh, got it.
These guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for... engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. in a documentary. No. Shut up. Come on. Let's go. hunted by literal monsters, and this is what bothers you? Yeah, both are bad. What's this? Harem Scarum. Seeing this, Caitlin? So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Oh, I hear that, no. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um. Just, uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. All right. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. 
Okay, let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Come back, grab her. Now you're falling away, will you? What the hell is going on? My bad. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. All right. Here goes nothing. I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just... I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. What'd you find? Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know what's up there. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there, there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. Okay. Guess that makes sense. Right? 
Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, yeah. that was that was close. Needs a rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out. Maybe I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Watch your step. Yep. What was that? I think we found Chris Hackett. Son of a bitch. Motherfucker, you crocked ass cop piece of shit. I'm not scared of you. Come on.
What the, what the fuck? Why am I on top of a fucking tree? Laura! Where the hell are my clothes? You gotta be kidding me. Okay. Gotta find Laura. Should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. Hopefully they realize the camp is closed and try the motel up the road. <gasps> okay. Okay, Caitlin. The rain's been off and on all night. These fuckers know you're in here. They're coming back first chance they get. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Okay. I need to get to a vantage point.
How long has this guy been here? Showtime, motherfuckers. What is going on out there? Should we go find the others? No! We're safer in here and it's nearly morning. What the? Let her in. Oh, we can't. The office door's locked from the outside. But there must be something we can well, do. Yeah, but what? <laughs> Silver shells. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. If she passes.
Silver! Hey, hey, I'm here! 